Good morning, teachers. Today, uh, we'll talk to you a little bit about digital notebooks. So fortunately, Slides Mania has a free version of a digital notebook that you can simply edit and you can use it with your students next year. So first of all, why would you want to have a digital notebook? Okay, so we could possibly be, well, probably, be going back on virtual teaching. So then your students, if they had virtual notebooks, could simply share their notebooks with you online. So whether you are there teaching in person or not, you can have them uh, try to use a virtual notebook, a digital notebook that is, okay? So the way the digital notebook is set up is by topics. So these are the different sections that your notebook is going to have, okay? So on the first slide, you just change the title to your subject area, I guess, and then um, subtitle, I guess that could be the student's name. Um, here are some more instructions and uh, they suggest you duplic duplicate the pages, of course. Um, so there's your topic A, so let's say that was vocabulary. Then on the next page, okay, you repeat the title and then the students would start typing this in. So what you can actually do is kind of pre-edit this before you pass it out to your students. So let me look at mine. Okay, so I made a, up a very simple one for French one for next school year. So I just put French one and then I put my name. So of course they can change it to their name. And then um, this our school in 2020. So here's the instruction page. So I'm not going to delete that. I'm just gonna leave that there for the students. So my first topic is basic conversation questions. So we're going to build up on these questions throughout the term. You start with simple stuff like, bonjour, comment ça va, ça va bien, and stuff like that. So then we would add to the questions as time goes by. Okay. The next one I have is call and response. So this is where the teacher says something and then the students automatically say a specific response back like bonjour, and they all say bonjour, madame, like that. So these would also add uh, up throughout the school year. Okay, so the next one I have is classwork. So they would put their activities there. Then I have a section for homework. And of course, vocabulary lists. I have verb conjugations, other grammar topics, and notes. Okay, so this template, as I said, it was made by Slides Mania. So these are free, and you can uh, use these as Google Slides or PowerPoints, as a matter of fact. So always leave these slides in there to give Slides Mania the credit, okay? So then if I wanted to share this with my students, I just go on the share button and I will share it with them. And then the students can individualize these and then when I want to check somebody's notebook, they just share it with me and I can check it. So this is how you create a digital notebook. This is Ruth from Teach Tech, Learn Tech with Wolf.